last ride before the rats. Just finished the ride. Yeah. It rained, I got wet. You're not gonna believe this. I just got in and um okay, I weighed myself after my ride, which which isn't always great, but weighed myself. I'm 132.2. That's I'm gonna work that out for you, but that's pretty low. In fact that's a lot lower than when I last weighed myself like a few days ago. Well, that's it. Everything's packed up. Bike, check. Suitcase, check. Rucksack, check. Let's go. I have no idea how to zoom this thing. Don't have to. I think you can see it. There it is. The famous hotel. The hotel I won the under 23 national championship. They actually put it there, but that's where we stayed. They always wave when we go past them. Yeah. <laughs> Pad in there. Brilliant. since I've been here anyway. Like the whole security setup, the whole like, I think the whole thing has just been expanded on the inside at least. Didn't look any bigger on the outside, but it's a pretty decent airport.
Still raining quite heavily. Oh, we've arrived at the hotel, uh, City North Hotel in Dublin. Our flight was good. Our flight was very good. Um, paid for it myself. So uh, most of the guys came out. Uh, probably, well, actually, all the guys came out on the boat. They came out the ferry from Holyhead. But I decided to um, I decided to fly plainly because it just takes so long to get anywhere from where I live. So I figured they're just going an hour out to the airport, uh, well, hour and a half to Bristol Airport, and flying across was so much more economical for me and uh, so much less stressful. So yeah, that's the way it works logistically. Shine with uh, Shine with Gullen, James Gullen. So, I think we've got like, so there's us two in this room and then there's three other guys in the other room. It's Bibby, Moses, McCarthy. Yeah, really excited. Just had food and um, I think I'm going to unpack all of this absolute rubbish I brought with me. I've got this full of kit, I've got that like full of kit and food. That's just, well empty space. guessed already I'm here for the RAS well we are here for the RAS and uh, it's eight days of hotly contested racing through some of the to be honest best countryside I've ever raced through uh, I'm not just saying that because people of the RAS might be watching this but genuinely it is it's like it's like racing in Wales like being at home right here and I really really love it um, so if there's any if there's any like comments uh, you want to leave any questions rather you want to leave down below as to what you want to see and possibly if you want me to do any live streaming and what you want to see on that um, that would be much appreciated but if not I'm just going to bang out some vlogs um, some will be absolutely of no use to you, some of you you might pick up some useful tins and tips and nuggets in it but um, yeah that's where I'm going to end so we're going to tune in tomorrow for the first stage <laughs>